hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna be sharing with you guys my spaghetti recipe <laughs> inspired by my leftover vegetables so basically these are just leftover veggies from dishes that i cooked um earlier in the week and i am due for a grocery run and this is what i currently have and i just want to finish it all up i added some french beans carrots bell peppers and this um vegan sausage mushrooms from tofu the tofu was frozen and then defrosted and now i'm just gonna pan fry it together with the sausage and it's the main ingredient that's gonna give us that meaty ish texture and I just crumbled it with my hands and yeah, we're just gonna make it brown. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying, but yeah, I don't know what I'm showing you guys either. So yeah, I'm using this vegan butter to saute for my sauce. I had to check if it's suitable for cooking and thank goodness it is. I ran out of regular oil that I usually use for sauteing so this is what we're gonna work with today and I'm gonna start off with my onions and a pinch of salt I always add a pinch of salt to help you know the onions release its juices and then the garlic and the carrots <laughs> So I'm just going to keep sauteing that to cook it for a little bit before I turn it into the spaghetti sauce. And I added garlic powder and Spanish paprika. I usually add my spices um, while I'm sauteing. I feel like it just releases the flavor better. And I added a bit of water so I don't have to add extra oil as I saute along. I added... Um, my leftover canned mushrooms and a little bit of mushroom powder seasoning and some sexy um <laughs> cherry tomato shots but yeah i used half of the can for okra gumbo earlier this week and i didn't i wasn't able to finish the whole can so i want i didn't want to throw it out so yeah, I used it for this um, spaghetti sauce, but to be honest, I would prefer fresh tomatoes. It's just my preference, but since I have it on hand, I used the canned one. At this point, I just um, adjusted everything before I let it boil. I added sugar and a little bit of soy sauce, laurel leaves, pepper, and I honestly let this simmer for maybe 40 minutes um just so everything can get married and happy together <laughs> and then i added the rest of my veggies my bell pepper and my french beans again it's just left over from another dish and i added my meats um fake meats <laughs> but yeah this is vegan sausage by the way i'm not sure if i mentioned that but yeah definitely vegan sausage and look how filling that is and now i'm gonna boil some fettuccine um i ran out of spaghetti i would i prefer spaghetti over fettuccine but it is what it is <laughs> and yeah now it's time for plating so usually at the end of the week i like to whip up like a pasta dish just to be able to use up all my remaining ingredients and so yeah this week it's this and i also like this with some zucchini broccoli asparagus honestly anything <laughs> and on top i just put some nutritional yeast for added protein and cheesy flavor a little bit and some dried moringa leaves or malungai leaves and there you have it super quick and easy and simple and yummy and clears out your pantry and yeah my
toddler really loved it she doesn't like eating french beans but for some reason she ate all the french beans i gave her through this pasta dish so yeah that's how you know it's good